Civics, History and Government, Questions for the Naturalization Test. The 100 civics questions and answers for the naturalization test are listed in this video. The civics test is an oral test, and the USCIS officer will ask the applicant up to 10 of the 100 civics questions. An applicant must answer 6 out of 10 questions correctly to pass the civics portion of the naturalization test. This video includes 10 exam sets. Each set has 10 questions and answers randomly ordered. Did you get 6 out of 10 questions correctly to pass? Let us know by writing in the comments. What does the Constitution do? Sets up the government. What are the two parts of the U.S. Congress? The Senate and the House of Representatives. What group of people was taken to America and sold as slaves? Africans. What are two rights in the Declaration of Independence? Life, liberty. What is one thing Benjamin Franklin is famous for? U.S. Diplomat Who does a U.S. Senator represent? All people of the state What major event happened on September 11, 2001 in the United States? Terrorists attack the United States. What does the judicial branch do? Reviews laws. Who was president during World War I? Woodrow Wilson. What are the two major political parties in the United States? Democratic and Republican. Name your U.S. representative. Answers will vary. Please visit this website. What stops one branch of government from becoming too powerful? Checks and balances. Why does the flag have 13 stripes? Because there were 13 original colonies. The idea of self-government is in the first three words of the Constitution. What are these words? We the people. 
Who was president during the Great Depression and World War II? Franklin Roosevelt During the Cold War, what was the main concern of the United States? Communism What are two rights of everyone living in the United States? Freedom of speech, freedom of religion. Name one state that borders Canada. New York. Who makes federal laws? Congress. What is the supreme law of the land? The Constitution. What is the name of the Vice President of the United States now? Kamala Harris. What did the Declaration of Independence do? Said that the United States is free from Great Britain. What did the Emancipation Proclamation do? Freed the slaves. How many justices are on the Supreme Court? Nine. Why did the colonists fight the British? Because of high taxes. What was one important thing that Abraham Lincoln did? Freed the slaves. Name two national U.S. holidays. New Year's Day, Christmas. Who is one of your state's U.S. Senators now? Answers will vary. Please visit the link. We elect a U.S. Representative for how many years? Two. What are two cabinet level positions? Secretary of Education, Secretary of Labor. Who is the father of our country? George Washington. Name one right only for U.S. citizens.
Vote in a federal election. What are two ways that Americans can participate in their democracy? Vote or run for office. Who is the Chief Justice of the United States now? John Roberts. What is the capital of the United States? Washington, D.C. Who lived in America before the Europeans arrived? American Indians. What do we show loyalty to when we say the Pledge of Allegiance? The United States. Who wrote the Declaration of Independence? Thomas Jefferson. Who vetoes bills? The President. What is the capital of your state? Answers will vary. Please visit the link. Name one war fought by the United States in the 1900s. World War One. What is the rule of law? Everyone must follow the law. What is one reason colonists came to America? Freedom. What movement tried to end racial discrimination? Civil rights movement. What is one responsibility that is only for U.S. citizens? Vote in a federal election. Name the U.S. war between the North and the South. The Civil War. Who is the Commander-in-Chief of the Military? The President. In what month do we vote for President? November. Before he was president, Eisenhower was a general. What war was he in? World War II. The House of Representatives has how many voting members? Four hundred thirty five. 
Name one U.S. territory. Guam. Name one American Indian tribe in the United States. Cherokee. We elect a U.S. senator for how many years? Six. What is the economic system of the United States? Market economy. What ocean is on the west coast of the United States? Pacific Ocean. Name one state that borders Mexico. New Mexico. What is freedom of religion? You can practice any religion or not practice a religion. What ocean is on the east coast of the United States? Atlantic Ocean. If both the president and the vice president can no longer serve, who becomes president? The Speaker of the House. Name one of the two longest rivers in the United States. Mississippi River. When is the last day you can send in federal income tax forms? April 15th. The Federalist Papers supported the passage of the U.S. Constitution. Name one of the writers. John Jay. How many U.S. Senators are there? One hundred. Name one branch or part of the government. President. There are four amendments to the Constitution about who can vote. Describe one of them. Citizens 18 and older can vote. What is the highest court in the United States? The Supreme Court. Under our Constitution, some powers belong to the federal government. What is one power of the federal government? To print money. Who signs bills to become laws?
the president. Under our Constitution, some powers belong to the states. What is one power of the states? Give a driver's license. What did Susan B. Anthony do? Fought for civil rights. What does the President's Cabinet do? Advises the President. What is one right or freedom from the First Amendment? Speech. Why do some states have more representatives than other states? Because they have more people. When do we celebrate Independence Day? July 4th. Who is in charge of the executive branch? The President. Where is the Statue of Liberty? New York Harbor. George Washington. What group of people was taken to America and sold as slaves? Africans. What is the name of the President of the United States now? Joe Biden. Name one war fought by the United States in the 1800s. The Civil War. What is the name of the Speaker of the House of Representatives now? Mike Johnson. If the President can no longer serve, who becomes President? The Vice President. There were 13 original states. Name three. New Hampshire, New York, New Jersey. What happened at the Constitutional Convention? The Constitution was written. When was the Constitution written? 1787. What is the political party of the President now?
Democratic Party. What is the name of the national anthem? The Star Spangled Banner. Why does the flag have 50 stars? Because there are 50 states. Who did the United States fight in World War II? Japan, Germany, and Italy. Who is the governor of your state now? Answers will vary. Please visit this website. How old do citizens have to be to vote for president? Eighteen and older. What do we call the first ten amendments to the Constitution? The Bill of Rights. When was the Declaration of Independence adopted? 1776. July 4, 1776. What is an amendment? A change to the Constitution. When must all men register for the selective service? At age 18. Name one problem that led to the Civil War. Slavery. What is one promise you make when you become a United States citizen? Be loyal to the United States. How many amendments does the U.S. Constitution have? Twenty-seven. What territory did the U.S. buy from France in 1803? Louisiana What did Martin Luther King Jr. do? Fought for civil rights Thank you for watching. Did you like this video? Please give us a like and share it with everyone. Good luck and goodbye.